hi guys welcome back again to gist with goalie b in today's video i'll be giving you an update about genius pop both accident is better and everything and how everything is going at the moment currently one of the crew members has been buried abigail miss abigail has been buried and she was buried at the well at the water side yes she was buried at the river side they see that there's a tradition that whoever that die around the river or dies in the river must be buried around the river and according to this under rumor is that her family does not have money for them to transport her from delta asaba down to aquaibum because she is from aquaibum state so she was buried beside the water and not just her, another, the makeup artist has been found and she was found dead. And the sound guy was also found dead too. And all of them are going to be buried at the water site. It's just all the uh, junior post family that don't want their son to be buried at the water site. It's just the only one. And that family are saying, no, they cannot bury their son at the water site because, or maybe of, maybe because of personal reasons. Or if you want, the, and the people are saying that he must be buried at the water side because it was because he died in the river. So I don't know how is this is going to go. So people are saying that he has to, um, they have to bring like thirty million or thereabout before he can be buried wherever he wants to be buried. I really, really don't know how true this is. I I don't know anything about this, but I could remember it. I have a personal experience of someone that died in the river. Then I was still little, and is it this happens to even be a pastor son? I went to a small river. This this, this happened in Abuja, Guagualada, precisely. He went to Guagualada River to wash clothes, and that was how. He, I don't know how it happened, but he drowned in the river. As a pastor son, he was still buried beside the water i was still buried around the water side so i don't know what junior pope's family are saying but it's a big loss to the entertainment industry to the nollywood in the fact to the nollywood industry to nigeria as a whole because this man is just 39 years old with three sons three young guys three young boys that are still little that still needs their father that still needs their father and one, they still need a father figure and one their life. And then we have his beautiful wife who have just been a widow at a very young age. This is something that nobody in this life prays for. But this is something that can actually also be prevented. This, can, this is something that can be prevented if there was a life jacket provided for them. I, can, I, I don't even understand how someone would go to a river as big as this without a life jacket. On every swimming pool, <laughs> on every swimming pool, I could not enter without a life jacket. I have to get a life jacket personally before I could get into a swimming pool of eight feet tall. Eight feet, I'll be ten feet tall. If I personally could get into it because there was no because there was a life jacket. So there, like, there was a floater. Like no, I can't get into water with, with the floater. It has to be a life jacket. So I was given a life jacket to get into a swimming pool. Talk more of such kind of river. So I feel like this is this is something that has to do with negligence. Yeah, this is negligence, and it is was taken to precaution by the producer, by the directors, and everybody in the uh, the crew. This would have actually been prevented, and this wouldn't have happened in the first instance. Well, rest in peace to Junior Pope, and rest in peace to Abigail. Rest in peace to the makeup artist. Rest in peace to the guy is precious. Yes. Rest in peace to precious. Rest in peace to the sound guy. Rest in peace to I think there are two other I think there are two sound guys, right? Abby? Rest in peace to the cameraman, whatever. Rest in peace to them. I pray they are so found rest and they're going to be happy. So we have a survivor who came out and explained every single thing of how the water, how the, how the um, accident happened, the boat accident happened, how another boat came from nowhere, maybe the, maybe the boat came to catch fish, he narrated how everything happened, and how the pilot of the water, of the boat, sorry, was trying to dodge, and it was, everything didn't sink, and it turned. 
It's a very sad event because they were 12 on the boat. According to him, they were 12 on the boat and only seven survived. So there were five casualties, not quite, there were five deaths here. Yeah. Five dead and seven survived it. These five of them involved, include Junior Pope, Abigail, Precious, and then the two sound guys. That makes them five of them. Precious is the makeup artist, while Abigail is one of the ladies too, and the crew members too. So seven survived and five were dead. I just want to thank God today that I'm alive. I'm, I'm a survivor from it. The situation that happened yesterday towards 1.30 to 2 in the afternoon. We're all on the boat. Junior Pope, TC Virus, myself, Tango Dikoma Idoma, Scoobindu, and the director of movement, the production manager, Ogolo, and a lot of them. On our way going to another destination on top of the river we're all having some good conversation suddenly raising our head up we saw a normal canoe boat i don't know if he's looking for fish or whatever and we are very close so close our pilot was trying to dodge and the canoe guy was trying to paddle fast to dodge but he could not make it and we are that very close there are another prophetess she called herself a prophetess she came out and said that this wouldn't have happened if only um if only Gina pope's family if only Gina pope and his family appeased the gods that Gina pope's mother got Gina pope because she was 40 years when she gave birth to Junior Pope. I oh, asked yes, no, I think it was going to be cool. It was going to get to 40 years. Uh, at the age of 40 years, something like that, Junior Pope has to appease the whatever, the water goddess, because Junior Pope was got it from the river, from the water. So she has to appease, the family has to appease. And then Junior Pope said, no, he's a Christian. I don't get to any, go to appease any gods. And like that was the main reason that Junior Pope lost his life where he got to the water. I really, really don't know how true this was because this is not the first day this this happened. This is not the first day. Junior Pope was that passed that water for like three days before this incident happened. It's actually just be this actually just be an unfortunate incident that just happened. And this is so so bad. So so bad. But they call this something that can actually be prevented. This is something that on a normal day, it can be prevented. If there was a life jacket, highest thing that would happen that they will sink down. They after like in less than a minute, they will come up. Yeah, they will come up. They will start floating at the top. So this happen that they will just hold their breath, hold their breath for some few um, minutes or for a few seconds, and they will come up. So that the way they will swim is different from the way they will swim without a life jacket. But I'm really. I'm really shocked that this just a big production, a big industry as Nollywood, such thing is still happening. And other people that are saying that this is spiritual, they sacrifice in your pub. I don't know how true this is. I really don't know the story. I don't know how true it is. So people are saying I will sacrifice, or people are saying that they have to join the cult, or people are saying, people are saying that everybody just bring different, different, and different rumors. So at times you don't even know the one to believe. Anyway, guys, I really don't know what more to say because this is tragedy since I've heard of this news since on um, since two days now. This news has been going around and that's really be a heartbreaking event, a very heartbreaking story that just happened. Nobody reached for anybody to die at a very young age. Like this, just 39 years, not even up to 40, 39. Like I said before, Juno Pope is the least person I expect to die this year, like in the Nollywood industry as you would. But he's a young guy full of life, vibrant. 
He's the, he do his thing, the swagalicious things. I love his dressing. I love the way he does, does his thing. Just, just sweet. He's not looking for trouble, just on his own. He doesn't put him out whatever that not concern him. He's a good father. From the videos I've watched so far, he's a good father. He loves his family so, so much. I really do not know why such a sad event would have happened to him. I really do not know why. I really, really do not know why. Anyway, thanks so much for watching this video to the end. See you guys on my next video. But before then, please don't forget to subscribe. Turn on your post notification bell so you'll be notified whenever I drop a new video. Please like this video. Share your thoughts down in the comment section. And let's discuss over this day and how we can as they make a campaign or make an awareness of life jacket. is very important. Both in the swimming pool and also in the river yes so because people that don't know how to swim and they get into the swimming pool please let every single hotel or um, all these people that get the house for when they call them what they call the house rental people let every single one of them have a life jacket as far as you have water in your house or in your compound please have a life jacket or a floater yes either a life jacket or a floater in the water those two are very very important and nobody should get into the river without a life jacket this should this should be an awareness like maybe we can raise an awareness we can kind of a campaign that every single place that every single hotels that has a war a swimming pool must have a life jacket and every single river before the boat will move or before the captain will drive that boat there must be a life jacket provided for each and every person entering that boat there is no more entering river without life jackets who you be oh my they fear water person needs you know now you feel me poor they carry life jacket they enter talk more of the river and it's a sad one anyways it's a sad one for the industry like i said for thanks so much for watching the video to the end see you guys on my next video i'm going to give you guys a next update very soon so see you guys on that new video but before then like subscribe don't forget to subscribe and stay tuned. Bye for now. Leak. Anybody killed him. John Pope was given to his mother. Junior Pope was given to his mother. Throw water. And they have taken him. Because he refused to acknowledge who he was. God bless you all.